The county residents are being forced out of their homes thanks to the great amounts of rainfall we've had since Hurricane Michael. County officials say the issue is above their head, but they're doing what they can to help these residents. News 13's Ashton Williams has more. For more than three months, some residents in Washington County have watched water levels rise over the roads and right into their homes. Some say they have had to temporarily relocate. Others say their home is a total loss, so they salvaged what they could. We have two boats. We've made constant trips down there and got what we could out. We got it over there in that yard, and we got some in a shed down there. Got the truck full. Unfortunately, there's some still down there, but we have no place to put it. Thursday morning, dozens of residents met with county officials to voice their concerns. County Administrator Jeff Massey says they're doing all they can to help these residents. We have been reaching out since the beginning of this, trying to figure out what assistance we can get, what programs we can put in place, because we know this will happen again. In the meantime, neighbors are trying to help neighbors, like Scott Hobbs, who lives on higher ground. We've got a couple of neighbors just down the hill from us that used to use a road that is no longer passable. Uh, so we've actually been allowing them to come through our property and actually park on our property. And there's an elderly couple that are in their 80s, and they're actually having to walk through the woods to get to their home. Residents say at this point all they can do is sit back and wait and hope for long-term solutions soon. Ashton Williams, News 13, Panhandle Strong.